Okay. Yeah, this, this game's actually pretty dope. I was playing some of it the other night. Ah. Yeah, it reminds me a lot of Ninja Turtles. Yes. Uh, just gameplay-wise. And the other one I was I was having fun with uh, the other night was uh, I was playing the the Japanese version of Panic Restaurant. That one's pretty. That one's pretty fun too. I guess I can sit back now. But yeah, you can like level your sword up and stuff. I think I got to hell last time. Southern Cave, okay. You'll find shops. Okay. Sorry, I didn't realize this was gonna throw me out like that. Fucking hammer bros, stop. That's probably a stupid decision. Yeah, I shouldn't have gone in the water like that. It's all good. And if there's any Famicom stuff you guys would want to see, let me know, because 
I have the the EverDrive cart here. I have a lot of translated uh, translated Famicom games, Famicom games, and I also have uh, you know all the English ones. So. I actually have a lot of NES games. I think I have about 200 something. It's just a It's just a pain putting them in and out of the system all the time. Ooh. Well, and then stuff like this. You can't even play stuff like this. Hold on. Okay, I need 200. Sorry, I'm sm smelling that plastic stuff in my hands now. that the enemies drop so many health health uh, pickups it's actually something um, that's pretty rare in NES games a lot of the times it'll be really hard to refill your health or get more health like kill that guy like right away basically oh I'm so close yeah maybe I'll play around a Galaga or something And he would drop health now. Uh, damn. Come on, drop health. There we go. I just wanted one little piece of health. should just keep doing that so that way I could just blast through all these enemies Yeah, 
I think I'm gonna want another sword upgrade. That's what it feels like. Oh, well, this is the stupid brick wall I can't get through anyways. much safer just to grind that one guy I think but the way he walks in the map he's like Ooh, like when he walks up like Ooh. <laughs> oh man you never find that too much anymore everybody does kind of the same style or a similar style like uh, sprite work after a while so I kind of liked about a lot of these earlier games as you saw more crazy crazy stuff well he's not giving me gold but he is healing me so oh there you go Fuck. I hate that. Fuck. Improving my sword skills. I guess I kind of am, because I've been proving, like, where the sword hits, at which angles the sword hits. Oh, that's good. Let me just do that. Shit. Yeah, fuck it. This level's not hard. There's no cliffs to fall on, at least. I love that eye peeking out of the pillar like that. It's sick. are getting feisty now. Yeah, I'm sorry though, guys. I, I know I was pretty close to beating the Jill side of things. But I got a Marvel vs. Capcom 2 Dreamcast disc to work, and that thing has, like, you could, like, see through it on certain parts. So...
so close. Yeah, and I'm only going to use save state to save progress, so... So like when we level when we level up the sword I'll save it, but not I don't wanna like save it before I fight a boss over and over like keep loading it over and over. Seventy-seven. Yeah, this this is probably the safest way, just because those other guys are pretty hard to fight. We're not, I guess, not hard to fight, but just until I can kill them in one hit, some of those guys are a little annoying. I need to try some more runs at Ninja Gaiden. I, I'll i only do that on the actual cartridge, though. I don't... Because I've beaten it with safe states on the PSP. And, uh... The whole point of that game is beating it without... It's just a one-run, you know, beat it without safe states, so... Game I'm kind of just playing for fun, so playing it for funsies. All right, let's get that sword. I forgot that's 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 the place that I need the bomb or I need some kind of item to break through those uh those stones. I want to say it was this way. Cuz that's another shop. Oh, you know what? I have to go left first cuz I have to get the pass. Damn, did that guy give me a hundred gold? No. But yeah, I do need that pass, so... Shit. No, that guy randomly drops a hundred gold. Wonder if it's just this guy too. figure out the, the cheapest thing in this game it's 
So I'm just going to go back and level my sword up. There's a there's a uh an armor level up too, I think. Yeah, I just found the best guy in the game, I guess. Or early on, the best guy early on to just That's a lot of gold. Speedrunning techniques. Alright, let me go get some sword upgrades. Because that'll make it even faster. No, that's just the the armor upgrade. I'm trying to remember where the pass is. It's to the top left, I think, is where that pass is. see how much damage I do now. Unless I can only buy that sword upgrade once. In which case the game the game has cheap stuff but it's also cheap uh cheap stuff to exploit but also cheap stuff to screw you over. It's the cheapness goes both ways. Yeah, I think I can only upgrade it so many times. I'm gonna get enough for that armor and the health, though. Feels like he only takes one less hit. Okay, so you only want to do the sword upgrade once, though. Or twice, actually. Well, okay, so I did the sword upgrade once, once or twice before I came in here. Does it just give you less effect each time? Because he does take six hits instead of five hits now. But that was like three levels or something. I don't know, I'm just gonna rack the money up so when I do find another shop... I find another shop, we'll try to upgrade the sword again.
Might play Ninja Turtles with save states, I'm not gonna lie. But again, just to save my progress so I don't have to go through the whole fucking game when I lose all my lives. I think if used in the right way, it can be... It can definitely feel more rewarding. But again, though, if you're if you're doing it for yourself, it doesn't really matter. It's more so you're just... It's not really something you're, like, wanting to brag about or anything. You just want to kind of do it. Like, this game, I just want to see more of this game, because I think it's fucking cool. Yeah, look at that skull up there. It's all, like, mean looking. I don't know, I feel like I'm doing more damage to these guys, so... Also, damn it, I didn't go to that shop. That's all good. I, I need to get the pass anyways. You want a pass, don't you? Then fight me, will you? Yes. I still don't know what those other items do either. Cause there's like a there's like a potion and something else. And a thing that looks like a bomb, but it's not a bomb. So it must just increase your stats or something, because you can't you can't like use it. Or at least I haven't figured out how to use it. I was always amazed by these early games. Like, these early Famicom NES games. Because there's only, you know, you only have four buttons on the D-pad. And I've always... There's always such unique ways people have thought of to do stuff. Oh, well thanks for the raid, Abby. I appreciate that. How's your night going? I'm gonna go back to... Well, that's where I use the pass. Let me go down to the store first, though. So I'm gonna get some armor and some uh, other items. Buy something. Uh, let me buy this thing. I don't know what it is. Fireball. Bomb. It's going well. How you doing? Oh, I'm doing pretty well. Just kind of chillaxing, hanging out. Seeing how to play this game, or I guess finding out how to play this game. Just finished a long day of playing Final Fantasy VIII. Oh, nice! Good old Final Fantasy VIII. You know, I, I, I always want to play through that game again because there's parts of the story I'm not like I don't agree with a hundred percent, but I love the music in that game. And I really like, like, the characters. I think Laguna is my favorite character. I soft reset it. Let me see. No, I still have the pass. Because I got that devil. I got that devil's pass. I, uh, so down and start. Down and start is save, and then up and start is load. So I've just been trying to stay away from the up button with the start button. Which I wish there was an easier way. 
Maybe I can map it to controller two for that, so that way I'm not accidentally pressing it during during gameplay. Because that's what happened last time. I got all super far in this game, and then I loaded state from the very, very beginning of the game. <laughs> yeah, the music in Final Fantasy VIII is amazing. The Balm Garden theme? I could listen to that theme for, like, ever. Okay, so look. There's these barriers. Is there a way... I, I must be missing something. Unless, unless I get something later on to go through those barriers. There's gotta be a way... To break through those... Pass it. Hold on. Maybe it's this way. This game is pretty fun, by the way. I wanna... I wanna get through this game. That's a life, but I don't know how to get that life. It looks like the Flayed Man symbol from Game of Thrones. But there's another life over here. see what's down here then actually you know what I'm trying to remember if that's the door I went through it must have been now it feels like there's there should be some other weapons in this game or like other attacks because one of the attacks in the menu looks like a like a fireball. something. Yeah, I don't know what this shit does, though. <clears throat> I don't know. Maybe I should read up online to see what the, the items do. Okay, well, I know that's armor, I'm pretty sure. Let me buy, let me buy two of those. It's like with the sword, though, because the sword... So I definitely did more damage when I bought, like, three of them. But it kind of feels like you hit a point and it doesn't deal any more damage. It's either that or the increments are just so small that you have to level it up, like, a bunch to get any noticeable effect after a while.
yeah, I definitely didn't go here. That's good, though. I need to check out these other areas. There might be something I missed. Frog really didn't want to die. Something I need the rock for. Or I need something to break the rock with. Those things hurt me? Jesus, I didn't even notice that. No wonder I was so messed up. I was just jumping like willy-nilly into those things. I'm just gonna get my health back up. can before I check that. Skellyman. Expecting that thing. Alright, so this game's gonna get tougher, but just like positioning wise. there before. I know I did. I saw myself do it. Come on.
You seek is near, but your quest is still young. I give you this. I do remember that. Maybe I did go this way. No, I did go that way. Well, screw it. I'm just going to keep going this way, then. trying to remember which path it was. So much money. Oh, it's this way. No, it's this way, I think. I think. Wait, can I go this way too? Oh, there's different guys over here. So it's two little small guys over this way. It actually seems faster. Try not to get, to get hit too much. Need a devil's R pass. Oh, you have one. Go right in. Crap, I just found out that Bob Ross the Bob Ross theme wasn't made for Bob Ross's TV show. Huh. I'm trying to think of the theme now. But where did it where did it come from? It was made one year prior to the TV show. Oh. Man, I need to watch some more Bob Ross. And just like... Get better at drawing. You know what? I've been this fucking way. There's like a dead end that you can't do anything at.
It was pretty much a stock music. Oh, I gotcha. Sorry, I had to disable the links just because there were so many bots tossing links. If you want, uh, let me... I'll pull up the uh, Discord here if you want to, like, put any... Any links, you could always just post them in here. Um... I used to have a command for it, but um, it doesn't. Uh, it doesn't. It doesn't load properly. Hold on. What the hell? I'm sorry. Now I'm just curious what's going on. with this program. So sorry. You sent the link directly. Oh, okay. Well, thank you. I'll still uh, pull that up. It's apparently the web page wasn't loading and the app is being weird. Wait, I'm just making sure... Okay. I was making sure I was going the right way. But I actually have a... I have a music... Uh, a music section on there where I'll post songs every now and then. Which is pretty cool. Let me go ahead and... Okay. There you go. I just hope I find a shop soon. This guy's annoying as hell. Some Castlevania 2 secrets here. No, I just need to figure out. There's got to be like a specific item or something. I haven't found like any cool items yet. All I've gotten is like basic upgrades. Oh. I think my sword levels went up just from fighting though. Which seems weird, but I guess that's that's pretty cool. I commend you, hero. The isle is cursed with the slain demon spirits. Don't go to the cursed cave. Go see people. Dun, 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 dun. Buy something. Uh, yeah, we'll buy that because I don't know what it is. We'll buy that. Buy, buy that. We'll 
buy all your stuff. Because I don't know what it does. But maybe it'll make me walk through walls or something? It's not making me do more damage. Yeah, let me let me let me see if there's something I can do like attack wise. Fumadin. Yeah, I'm just curious what these other items do, because I keep buying items and I don't know how to use them. So let's go ahead and I'm going to go back to the main screen here so I can pull up my menu and see which items I have and what I can do with them. So... Paths through some stages have obstacles you can't jump over. Instead, you need a weapon capable of cutting through them. You can use the rock sword to cut a path through the walls and reach the destination on the other side. This weapon has the same power as your sword strength. Okay, so that's cursed dynamite, cursed clothes. How do you use your weapons then? Okay, so obviously there's a way to switch to your weapons then. You will collect items throughout the game that will help you on your quest. Some items can only be purchased. Attack items, defense items. Miscellaneous. Only one attack item and defense item can be active at any time. Pause the game and use the A and B buttons to cycle through your available attack and defense items. It doesn't look like I'm cycling at all, though. Hold on. Oh my god. Are you serious this whole time? Well, I guess I have all kinds of items then. Alright. And I just died because I wasn't paying attention to what the hell I'm doing. So let's see if I can use the rock sword here. Oh, 
Okay, so what do these other items do? What are the defense items do? So... Medicine will restore your health. Uh, that's a red charm. Can be used to instantly defeat the enemy that you happen to be facing. First person perspective. Can only be used once. Okay. The blue charm is used to instantly eliminate any enemies that happen to be on the screen in the side scrolling portion of the game. Okay. This is a defense orb. This item will activate a ring of burning rocks that encircle you while you run. Okay, so it's like a shield. Alright, so that wasn't. That sword wasn't upping my attack at all. The the sword that I that I got, that sword was basically the sword I need to break through rocks. So what was upping my attack was just going through killing stuff. So that's interesting. It also makes me wonder how many, um, how many potions I can hold at one time. Because really, I should just be buying, I should just be buying potions then. I mean, obviously I need the rock sword to get through certain areas. I swear I pressed A and B when I paused it, though. That's the annoying thing. But I think... I was pressing... <sighs> I was pressing A and B on this screen and not the other screen. And I think that's where the problem arose. Yeah, so now I gotta go back to all those sections where I can break the wall to see what else I missed. Okay, that's cool that I can go back though. Game's trying to hide its secrets from me, but... I will now figure out all its secrets. Thank you. 
I'm so bad at killing these guys. Oh, thank god. Alright, so let's find a passage with a rock now. This one just leads back. That's fine, I'm getting my health back. Damn it. Oh, hey. I'm back. I think I lost some gold, but fuck it, I'm... That's fine. I think I still have all my items, right? Yeah. That's interesting though, so I was literally just upping my sword by fighting those guys continuously. They had nothing to do with the the sword item. Okay, I can't go there yet. Wait, did the lives respawn on this level? Hold on. I'm sorry, I have to check that now. That can't be the case. If it is the case... Some Super Mario World shit. Oh no, that was money. I think it was just because I died. It's a Konami game, right? Yeah, this is Konami. I want to say it's made by the same guy that made the Ninja Turtles game, I'm pretty sure. I know I keep saying- I need to just look that up. I mean, I guess you could go back and forth and get pizza in that game. Hold on, I'm trying to remember which paths have the rock have the rocks now that I need to go through. Yeah, I got my money back anyways. No big deal. Okay. 
Okay, so this item is... This is a defense drum. Mamori Taiko. Provenance drum. Instead of swinging a sword, you beat this mystical drum, which produces a symbol, meaning force. The power is fixed at 10, regardless of your sword strength. Usually early on, when your sword is still weak, but once you gain strength, its usefulness diminishes. Okay. Interesting. I know I like RPGs, so I've always liked Enix and Square back in the day and Quint Quintet and everything. But I do have to say, uh, Konami and Capcom were some of the best third-party uh, third-party developers back then. Welcome to hell. You are to defeat the dragon and take back your family's great children. Now go and do battle. Okay. Oh my god, did this just bring me to the beginning of the game? Oh, okay. So that, that part was locked off. I gotcha. I mean, it doesn't really matter. Even if you go back and forth, even if you're like, I don't know where to go. This game is cool because you you level up your sword. So you're still getting more and more powerful. So when you do figure out where to go, you could still whoop things. I really like that aspect of it. I think that's really cool. It also does make it you could just sit there on one screen, level up constantly, but... Oh no. Sorry, I knocked that plastics over. Sword power. Run. I'd rather take hits than fall off the cliff. Cliffs are bullshit. Thank you. 
I would like to get to a password screen. I know I have the save states, but I would like to get to a point where I can save the the passwords, though, because that way, if anything happens, I could uh, just pop that sucker in. So there was a couple different areas with the rocks. One of them was over here. No, it wasn't this one. Sorry about that, guys. I think I already got to that path. I'm gonna double check it real quick, but I'm pretty sure I already went through this one. No, I didn't go through this one, I went the other way. I mean, I went through this one the first time, but... Oh, that's the Grim Reaper. Okay, I don't need to go through that part then. these maps sometimes too without like a without one of those um what is it called oh here we go this is a this is one of them or without a map I kind of hate the way these overworlds are set up, is a better better way to state that. Because it's kind of hard to see where the hell you're supposed to go. God, this is just the other side of this other place. Thank you. 
Damn it, there's gotta be another place I can go now. It just leads back. Oh, I need more health potions. It just shows one on there, though. So, here's the thing. Can I hold multiple health potions? Because I don't actually know. Well, let's see. No. So, this game will let you waste money if you already have that item and you can't stop... You can't stockpile them. It'll just make you waste money. That's interesting. Well, which rock place am I missing? So I need to go back to where I was. I was just pulling up a little map. Game's like, oh, you know how to use health potions? Well, you're gonna get less health pickups now. I feel more vulnerable now that I know how to use potions. I know I shouldn't feel that way, but... went the wrong way. It's this way. I 
I'll fight the Oni. Wait, the Oni gave me more health. I have to figure out how... Let me look at the map again. I have to figure out how to get to this place. Hold on. So I'm just going to save the map and pull it up. Okay, so I'm down here. If I go down there, it just leads to there. So I have to go up. Oh, damn. I've gotten more powerful. Come on, you son of a bitch. Okay. Gotcha. Alright, I think I know where to go now. No, it just helps me because, like, I get confused walking, like, which ways I've walked, where I'm supposed to be going, all that nonsense. Was there a shop over here? There's that guy. I'm just seeing if there's a shop on this side. There is a shop. Oh, I can keep going. So damn it. Earlier I could have kept I could have kept going. What the fuck? You weakling. Go home now and be happy. You still live. I'm actually controlling this. It's... I thought it was like a little cutscene for a second. I can't tell where the hell I'm going now.
Oh, what the fuck? Fuck yeah, slice this guy. Dude, I would have, like... I would have fucking... Like, if I had this game as a kid, this would probably be, like, my top, like... 10 games of all time. Yeah. Oh shit, was that the boss? I'm scared. Oh, these are just random enemies that are going to get fucked up. This game's like I've played a lot of like dungeon crawlers. Okay, I, I, the, I don't like not having a map, though, I will say that. That is, that is a bit annoying, but... Dude, I'm gonna have to check a map because I can't tell where the hell I'm going. I think I'm going in circles. Yeah, I'm going in circles here. Hold on. Okay. Hold on. I'm just seeing if there's a map for the, uh, because I'm going in like a giant circle. Here we go. Here's a map at least. I don't know where I am though. It seems like I'm in like a square, like a part that goes around in a circle. Because I, I hit the door. Nothing to the right. I should have been tracking this myself on graph paper. I have no idea where the fuck I am.
so lost. Okay, this part of the game they could have worked on a little bit, I think. Oh, I think I... There we go. At least I found somewhere else. Hold on. I'm just seeing which path I could be on. If that were the case. Well, I guess I'm just going to go through because I don't. Wait, be happy you still live. That's the main guy, right? Okay, I found the entrance, so at least I know. At least I find my way back to the entrance. Now the question is, which entrance... So, on the map I'm looking at, it doesn't really show which entrance I'm supposed to go, like... I'm just gonna download this, save this image again. There we go. As long as as long as I could see Okay, so let's see. Let's see if this is the entrance. So I open the door, go forward. There's that guy. And I step one step that way. See it's it's not the entrance then. There should be a monster right over here. Okay, I think I know where I was before, too. I got trapped in this little roundabout. I just kept going in a circle. And then I walked backwards. Alright, hold on. I'm just moving the chat real quick so that way I can still see the... So I can see the map and the chat. So walk forward, walk forward, walk forward, hit a wall, walk to the right, one step, two steps, walk to the left, door, and then monster. into the wall and then to the right one two three and then to the right one two three four there should be a monster down this way there we go Oh, 
cool. I fucked him up. Okay, so there's a door. Go forward. And then I need to go to the... Actually, let me see what's... what's in this. Looking for something? Let me help. It lives south. Or maybe it's southeast. Okay, and then I need to go to the... There we go. No, I need to go this way. That's what I mean, I'll like walk backwards and stuff. I'm looking at a map and I'm walking backwards. So if I was using graph paper and writing this down, it would probably take me about two hours of like writing down where I was at and what was going on. Down, 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 down. Left, over, 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 door. Over, 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 monster again. cheap with these guys because otherwise they shoot that fire okay let's go down and then to the left there's a door cool then we're gonna go up and there should be another door right here a okay, monster there's gonna be three monsters i'm gonna run into consecutively Should be a monster right here. Oh, that thing's terrifying. Alright. There should be another monster right here. Oh, nice. Just another lobster crab. So scary, a fire-mouthed mass. Yeah, I got four battles coming up. Now there is a potion after that. some lasagna or something hungry oh that bastard I didn't realize he was going to drop on me let's see if we can make it
Nope. Oh, thank God, did it start me at the same place? Yeah, these fights are way tougher than the other fights. have to hit him in the right place? Because it seems like if you hit him quick enough in the right place, you're good. Okay, so there should be a potion right here. Nice, and it just, it just works like that. Okay. I got one, two, three, four monsters, and then there's another potion. Kill this guy fast enough. Sweet. Alright, so we gotta go all the way down. It's not accurate. It's missing a door. That's interesting. Well, now I'm lost. here asshole I'm gonna farm some life fuck yeah oh never mind I didn't need that potion I just needed to run into these assholes Nice. 
I know it's cheap, but still. Wait a second. I know the sword's actually better than... Shouldn't have got rid of those fireballs. That was a fucking mistake. Oh no, I have the fireballs. Alright, this guy's better because I don't have to jump. Still have to be careful because he takes two hits, but hold on, I'm gonna get a drink. I'm just uh reallocating the chat or since I get out of the dungeon, I don't need that map up anymore. Hey, what's up, Polar? Yeah, this game's dope as shit. I had to use a map for the first person part because I am not good at those. More so, I just didn't feel like mapping it out. So I'm being a little cheap. That and I have. I'm not safe stating against bosses, but I'm safe stating like on the world map. Just so like if I have to go back, I don't lose all my experience and everything. Just grinding these guys for some health. Almost Betty by time for me, but I got so close that this I was like, you know what, I should just keep going. Now that I figured out what the items do and stuff. Got home from work and took a shower. Nice. Yeah, I'm gonna take a shower when I get off when I get off stream. I wish I could have enjoyed some of that wonderful sushi you set pictures of earlier. That stuff is. That stuff looked really good. And I know this is a little lame, but. It's just for health. And honestly, I used to. I used to think I had, had to get through the Mega Man games without grinding. Then I watched people play Mega Man, and I was like, oh no. People grind health all the time. If you ever get down here, hit me up. Oh, I will. I will indeed. Oh, shit.
I just gotta dodge. Fuck. Nightmare fuel. I feel you. Oh, Mountain Dew? Or giant I s samurai uh, heads with a with a giant eyeball. I guess he's a yokai. I've seen yokai that look like that. Oh, that boss. Yeah, it's dope as shit though. Like if if this game had come out in America, like if I had this game as a kid. I would have fucking loved this game to death. And I, I already do love this game. Like, it's it's probably in my top... I'd say it's probably in my top 100 games already, and I haven't even got that far, but... Oh, what was I gonna say? But, I mean, it would be... Oh, man, I can imagine... Playing this game as a kid over and over again. This game would have rocked my world. So I... Sorry, I suck at bosses, guys. Pull that map up again? Hold on. I'm so sorry, guys. I killed him, too. You saw that I killed him. But he just killed me at the same time. But now we gotta go through this bullshit again. I'd load my save, but I don't remember where I saved it. I think I saved it outside before I went in the dungeon. I don't know where the fuck I am. Like, I know that's this is supposed to be the entrance. See, I should have safe stated it, but I don't know. That's kind of what I mean. It's just like it, it already has the game already gives me infinite continues. I'm pretty much just saving it to save my progress kind of thing. Dude, I don't know where I'm at. I may actually have to just save it for the night because I literally don't know where the hell I am in the dungeon. Until I find another marker. Okay. I think I know where I am now.
Come on. That fire's bullshit. Okay, so if I go here and then I go left and then there's another monster, I know where I'm at. Find a door. Go through. The fuck is this? This guy just throwing me money? Sure. I don't know how this helps me, but... I guess it didn't hurt. It would be nice to see the walls, though, I will say that. Like, they could have done a little bit better job with the walls. Oh, nice. You have the emotes for those. Graphic for your dude looks badass. This dude is badass. See, it takes longer to just hit, 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 but it doesn't... What the fuck? Dude, this map is not accurate at all. I have to say that first, first and foremost. Like, there's just parts of this map that just aren't where they're supposed to be. Like, I don't know who, who mapped this out, but it's not... It's not accurate. Well, now that I'm thoroughly confused about where I'm going, I'm just gonna wander. I, I don't know where the hell I'm supposed to go. Okay, so it should be one, two steps, and then to the left, but it's not. And even if it was three steps to the left, but it's not. One, two, and then let's do one. And when you walk in and out of the door, the enemies respawn. You got the map right side up. Yeah, well, it's from the internet. It's only saved in one direction, so... 
Okay, then it's one step. One more step, there should be a door right there, according to the map. But even if you walk to the wall, you're supposed to be able to walk to the left. See, there shouldn't be an enemy here. That's, that's what I mean, whoever made this map is tripping. So now I'm back up here. Now, not all the map is inaccurate. There's a good portion of this map that is that is very accurate. It's just a majority of it is very inaccurate. That's fine. I need to... I'm going to save it. Because I need to go to the item shop and get a potion anyways. For one thing. And then for a second thing, I think I better go because it's already... For me, it's already about 4 in the morning and I gotta... I still have to take a shower and all that good stuff for work tomorrow. What the hell is this? Let me let me check to see what this is real quick. Oh, you know what? That's the other entrance. All right. Well, it's been fun. I'm definitely gonna play some more of this game eventually too. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and take off for the night but thanks for hanging out guys and you have a wonderful rest rest of your evening